Planet Arcade named after you. Look at this fucking horizon. Look at that color. Wow. That's that's just crazy. I'm assuming that's maybe it's dusk on this planet or this planet's version of dusk. Oh, I'm sitting here talking, not paying attention. Almost almost died, so that's what the jetpack is good for. So that you don't plummet to your death when you're not paying attention and you're admiring the beautiful sky. You hit this dude here and save at any point. get back in my ship on the first planet I really did think about you know flying around in my ship so <coughs> I walked everywhere and that was uh, that was quite a quite a trek so here's some water this is actually the first time I'm seeing water which is very red uh, interesting. I haven't tried to swim or anything, so I don't know what would happen if I set my ship down on this rock and try to swim, but let's... Uh, land, I guess I'll let me land because it's too much water, I guess. Let's try it again. to land. This seems kind of flattish. Maybe I can land right here. There we go. Cool. Alright, let's see what this water is about. Actually, I just noticed this, uh, this land, this world doesn't seem to be too toxic compared to the last one I was on. Um, but I do need to repair my, or Refill my life support. Alright, where was that thing at? There was a question mark somewhere in this water. I think it was on the, maybe on the other side of this big rock, which looks a hell of a lot closer when you're flying. You can actually see down into the water. Look at that. Some kind of little fish. No, never mind. That's something blowing in the wind. I was like, I thought it was a fish swimming. Alright. I am swimming. Uh, I guess that's my oxygen meter. Over on the left. Hope some giant crazy ass shark doesn't come along and decide to eat me while I'm under here. Back to the There we go. Or I drowned. There's the that's what I was looking for. Dude. dumb. The game won't let me just be out of the water. That's, uh, I don't understand that. Oh, 
Okay. So this is a uh, <laughs> grassland, apparently. I guess seagrass, I suppose. Now I'm gonna start drowning. There we go. Come on, stand on top of this rock. There you go. So the whole, uh, not being able to swim on the surface of the water is kind of weird. I don't know if I'm just not doing something right or... What the hell is this thing? This looks cool as shit. It's just a, just a source of carbon. You can see as you point to different places in the world, it'll tell you how long it'll take you to get there. And distance seems to be a little deceptive because I really didn't think I was that far under the water um, earlier. And it took me a hell of a lot longer to get back up to the surface than I thought it was going to. And again, I don't know if I'm doing something wrong here. Not being able to swim it on the surface of the water, but that's pretty annoying. There's some ships. Those are not players, those are uh, random ships that you see flying through the world and you'll also see um, them land at, there are uh, like depots in the world where they can land and you can go trade and possibly buy a new ship and stuff like that. bunch of stuff under the water on this planet and uh, I don't know maybe I can get an up upgrade for my suit that'll let me stay in the water longer but I don't know Just looking to see if I saw anything. Could be some animals I haven't discovered running around. Stuff like that. But again, this looks completely different than the first planet I was on. Hey, here's something on land for me to go look at. Let's see what this is.
those little um, things there on the map indicate where it's certain like resources are in the world. That was a bit of a drop. I think this kind of does like uh, on Assassin's Creed where you do the viewpoints. I think it, it unlocks and shows you where. So there's a advanced life form over there. If I walk to it, it will take me 30 minutes real time to get there. I think I'll fly my ship. But that just, you know, kind of shows you what the scope is on some of these worlds. to the ship and that to the ship oh yeah yeah no free slots I got it I need a bigger ship Gek charm I don't know if you could maybe give those to some of the people that you some of the aliens that you interact with um to gain favor or if you just sell them or again the colors you know really varied on this planet a lot of plant life a lot of uh, grass and stuff that I didn't see on the first planet so that's cool Oh shit. Uh let's go see what this advanced life form is. <laughs> That's quite a difference. <laughs> Thirty minutes versus three minutes. So definitely faster to fly around the planet. I guess night is uh, arriving and this planet is getting a bit of a green tint to it too. Something else over there to check out. Here is uh, there's a port back there where a ship can land. Let's see if it puts me on it. It did. Sweet. I've not landed on one of these before, so I don't know if this will uh, give me uh, some different options for my ship. Again, once I go unlock this, I will officially discover it. Yeah, so that's my second planet so far. Loving the game. 